Wright's home, I wanted to combine the rugged, simple style of the husband with the classic look that the wife loves. The nice thing about the master bedroom is it didn't need a ton of updating, but for this room, it was really a cosmetic change that we did. But again, we're talking about the blend of rustic and traditional. Two people, two different styles, but one room. We installed new hardwood floors in here. As you see, we have this really pretty, delicate chandelier. I think the chandelier just adds a really sweet, special touch to this room. It really makes it feel warm, cozy, inviting. Now the husband really wanted a sliding barn door. I didn't beat it up too much. I left it pretty clean and simple, pretty stained. I mean, this is something that you can build. The rustic door and the chandelier and the headboard really balance each other out. Here in the bathroom, I think is where you're really gonna see the biggest blend of both of them. You've got the marble backsplash, but the wood tile. You've got the marble countertops over here with the wood frame. So it's a really a blend of him and her. I really think this house was one of my favorites because it was blending two very different styles into one space and it worked. Since the shotgun house originally had 700 square feet, that wasn't enough for the client, so we decided to go up and add a loft. Now there's an additional 400 square feet to this space, and up here it's really fun because you've got the best view at the entire shotgun house, but you also have a view to the backyard. It could be multi-purpose up here. You could have a bedroom up here, office, and even a living space. What I decided up here was to keep it very simple so that the elements of the house were the things that really stuck out. I love the railing, the fun industrial pendant lights, and then you've got some decorative sconces over here that really frame out this beautiful wood window. I found these really cool vintage suitcases, so I thought it'd be fun to play with the design up here. We ended up mounting these to the wall, so now they have a new purpose as shelves, and they also make a really cool statement. From the beginning, the tiny shotgun house had a lot of big challenges, but in the end, the reward was huge. I think every design element that we got to incorporate really stood out. We love this house, and we were so glad to be a part of the shotgun house.